Yeah. Ellen, were you surprised by the allegations about P. Diddy? Did that surprise you about P. Diddy? So tell me about your birthday party. Am I invited? Yes. Yes, you're definitely invited. When I invite you to all my parties. You just haven't seen the show. The inevitable has finally come for Ellen and this lady. Now finds herself entangled in the controversy surrounding Diddy and his freak-off parties. Recently, paparazzi approached the TV host to ask her opinion on the serious allegations against her longtime friend Diddy the Music Mojo, who is currently facing backlash for his crimes, has frequently appeared on The Ellen Show. And it's also suggested that these two have been quite close, attending each other's bashes. There are now whispers that Ellen might have attended some of Diddy's secret parties. I'm talking about those huge glamorous, star-studded events commonly associated with him, but rather more private gatherings at his home. I mean, because, first of all, I, I have been struggling with it for a while. I really did think I was going to stop. Where and some alleged disturbing and potentially illegal activities took place under hidden cameras. And if you think these are just whispers of some enemies in Tinseltown, there's never smoke without fire. It's being wildly speculated that Ellen was privy to everything happening in Diddy's house and life, and she even slowly hinted at the music mogul's misconduct when chatting with some of his victims on her show back in the days when the music mogul vaguely described what they were up to, were we hanging out and what we're doing can't really disclose, but it's definitely a 15-year-old's dream, I have been getting custody of him well. Ellen's past behavior with Diddy's alleged victims kind of hint that she knows more than she shares with the public, which may make her an accomplice in Diddy's crimes and judging by the story circulating about Ellen and her mean nature. She could actually be one of the closest in the music vocal circle of Predator Pals. Pals. 20s, where are you going after this? What are you doing? You know what, you know what we doing, what we uh, plan to do, girl. These rumors persisted quietly. Until 2016, when Kathy Griffin blew the lid off in her memoir, Griffin recounted a tense encounter with a popular talk show host known for her short blonde hair later, confirming she was referring to Ellen as more celebrities, began voicing their encounters with Ellen's abrasive side with more than 2,000 stories, surfacing one of the most awkward examples was her 2008 interview. Mariah Carey pushed her guest to confirm pregnancy rumors by offering her champagne to prove she wasn't pregnant. That's not champagne because you can No, it is. One. Is it really? Yeah, you want to you wanna taste it? I can't believe you did this to me, Ellen. What this interview resurfaced in 2020 when Mariah expressed how this invasive moment had left her extremely uncomfortable, especially as she was dealing with a miscarriage at that time, I was extremely uncomfortable with that moment, is all I can say, and I really have had a hard time grappling with the aftermath. The narrative of Ellen's off-putting interactions weren't limited to her. Guess when Wendy Williams wants to light on Ellen's cold behavior towards her when discussing Ellen's announcement to leave her show after 19 years, Williams mentioned 19 years on TV. Doesn't change your life, it exposes you. For the person that you really are it appears that Diddy and Ellen share more in common than just celebrity status and public accusation. Both have been embroiled in serious allegations of mistreating their staff. The scandal surrounding Ellen's treatment of her employees have similarly tarnished her reputation. It's well documented that her once celebrated talk show was cancelled amid a flurry of accusations regarding her conduct towards staff toxic funny hypocrite liar. That's what she is. It's like Ellen is the female version of Diddy, she didn't even try to hide her real nature from anyone. Apparently, she had a firm belief that Diddy's reign in Hollywood will never end, and she would be safe from exposure. Yet with recent allegations piling up against him of essay and trafficking, it feels like everyone who was too close to the music mogul is getting down. But Ellen may be just the one to get her own Diddy treatment from everyone who she has mistreated in the past, she was known to leave passively aggressive notes for her. Household staff, which kind of paints a gruesome picture of what's been happening behind her closed doors, mansion ridiculous things. And then it just kept going and going and going her critical nature. Extended to all service personnel from handymen to security guards, leading to a top security firm in Hollywood, severing ties with her over trivial complaints, like the way guards walk as one of her former employees said she treated you like you were nothing she was going to torture you. And you were just going to sit there and listen to it, because you were being paid sounds like typical Diddy, who was throwing cash left and right, forcing people to do some absolutely crazy things for his own entertainment. And it seems like Ellen picked up the idea of total power from her close pal, whom she was secretly partying with if you know how to look at it tells not only her, but also the guests of her TV show, but even everyone who used to work for this lady described Ellen was the worst person he had ever met in July 2020. Buzz News released an explosive report involving anonymous testimonials from 10 former employees of her show. According to the report, workplace is notoriously toxic amid these allegations, almost all of Ellen's celebrity friends remained silent. Pattern now repeating itself with Diddy additionally, 
both Diddy and Ellen have been accused of mistreating those closest to them. Though in marked different ways, Diddy in particular has been accused of severe mistreatment towards his romantic partners. A lawsuit filed by his ex-girlfriend Cassie includes grave allegations of physical mistreatment, enforced abuse, and course of control, painting a disturbing picture of their relationship lawsuit is reportedly so graphic. Another insider and former bad boy artist claimed that Diddy's behavior also extended to another long-term partner. Kim Porter allegedly, Diddy once broke Porter's nose, and after their breakup, he had her followed and wiretapped her phone. Similar to what Diddy Ellen was exposed for her controlling behavior in a marriage and apparently her unruly character has remained a source of conflict for the couple, among other issues, close to the couple were saying that Portia Ellen's wife felt like she miserable all the time because of Ellen, she has never been more miserable in a relationship. She feels like a trophy wife, probably, this is how Ellen ended up. At Diddy's private gatherings, she has reportedly grown more possessive, fueled by fears that her wife Porsa might expose her less flattering traits to the media and found solace in letting her demons out in Diddy's estates while no one could see her. This aligns with the notion that birds of a feather flock together and speak about her friendship with Diddy well. They share numerous personality traits and behaviors Diddy has appeared on Ellen's show many times the last 17th appearance happened in 2022. And it seems like these two were having time of their life together. The spotlight on their relationship has brought several past interactions into focus, including playful yet revealing exchanges on her show, for instance, during a segment Ellen asked Diddy, whom he refers to as being stuck in an elevator with. And he immediately answered Kevin Hart without further explanation like these two have understood each other and the world doesn't need to dig into their secrets. And various clips have resurfaced, showing Ellen and Diddy discussing attendance at each other's parties in one Diddy teased Ellen about her habitual absence from his events, I invite you to all my parties, you just I haven't shown up these snippets show only demonstrate their close friendship and mutual enjoyment of each other's company and hint at a deeper connection and perhaps similar approaches to personal and professional and professional relationships all right and while ellen tries to lay low like the the rest of diddy's accomplices paparazzi shocked her with questions about diddy's allegations it seems like the tv host wasn't ready for this exposure and who knows what other secrets she may hide from the public, as usual fans didn't think twice before connecting how it looks like the situation is getting worse and worse for bad guys in Tinseltown, and many careers may be ruined by Diddy. But folks, what do you think about all this? This could actually be a part of Diddy's freak-offs considering her toxic nature and close friendship with the music mogul. Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to check my other videos.